Okay, guys, I've had a cup of coffee, and I just dropped my car off to the chiropractor um, to get my alignment and service, and um, so I'm a little bit uh, calmer, and I wanted to do a little clarification because, you know, I'm going to report to you on the spot, and I'm very excitable. Um, so let me explain to you what this video next to, to me actually means here. So the HSE, which is the Health Services Executive of Ireland, has these COVID pop-up centers, you know, where you go in, you get your PCR test. Um, so, uh, what is so interesting and why I was making such a big deal of it when we pulled up to get the test for Angelica was the guy told us, he goes, you're going to have to go to a private place, you know, the one you have to pay for, um, in order to get this. And he goes, cause these are, you know, these, these don't qualify as fit to fly. And I was like, uh, that makes absolutely no sense because with these COVID pop-up centers, and the reason this needs to concern you is because the statistics that everything is being based on is being taken from figures that are being collected by centers, just like this HSE COVID pop-up center. So if it's good enough to, uh, to deem positive or negative in order to drive the statistics of where we stand with our COVID infections, um, but it's not good enough to say if a person is positive or negative in order to fly. We got a problem, folks. So this is why that's such a big deal. So uh, now I take a breath and explain that um, because I'm just like, I was in shock. I was like, dude. And he goes, don't even say anything. And I was like, oh my God, I can't believe that just came out of your mouth. And he was like, I know. So anyway, that's it. That's that. And uh, yeah, keep questioning everything.